As I look at this young man right here, I talk to him. You can ask him the same questions that you can ask another kid from Michigan. If you ask him about what state school is the most predominant right now, what school would you say based upon football? Michigan. If you said based upon winning championships in Michigan, who's the most predominant school right now? Michigan State. See there? But the first thing people think about is Michigan. Because Michigan is a school that's already set the tradition. Teams are up there, so every kid knows them. It's like Oregon. Oregon's up there. People love them. USC has tradition. So who gets the biggest recruit between Oregon and USC? USC comes tradition. But Michigan is Michigan. Ohio State is the Ohio State. Michigan State is right now on top. They get their respect. Coach D'Antonio is the greatest coach around right now in the Big Ten. He's, he's setting a trend. But the most important thing is that Jim Harbaugh is changing things because of what he thinks. Jim Harbaugh is changing things because of the way he do things. Jim Harbaugh is coming out here because he's doing some hard gut check with kids. And he's trying to make kids realize, hey, you are not just attending college. You are attending Michigan. When you talk about you know all the good things about Michigan, the advantages they have, especially for Michigan kids, what does it take for Ohio State, schools like that, to come in and, and pull kids away from Michigan? It's, Do they have to work I'm, harder than other schools? I don't. I don't think it's all about what school the kid goes to. Like for me, I would love to have a kid go to Alabama because I think Alabama have great coaches. They got a great relationship with them, but. It's because of the relationship. It's because of the relationship I have with Coach D'Antonio. It's because of the relationship I'm building with Jim Harbaugh. It's because of the relationship I build with Coach Holmes and all these other schools. That's what makes it so positive. It's all about the relationship and me understanding that if I send my kid up the road, he's gonna get looked at. He's gonna, that's what it's all about. If Michigan didn't have a few rough years, would Ohio State have grabbed three in a row? If Michigan didn't have a few rough years, kids would still be going to Michigan no matter who the kids were. And I'm going to say this right here. Mike Weber would have loved to go to Michigan. If Michigan didn't have that rough patch, Mike Weber probably wouldn't have it turned over. If they didn't so that's end what up I'm firing, saying. Yeah, they didn't fire the coach and the team was in limbo. But would you let your kid go to a house with no babysitter is that? Yes or no? No, I know. That's right. But now I'm the babysitter who's I'm there. Not my ba I'm not letting none of my kids go to a house when everybody's home. I want the parents to be there. I want somebody to supervise them. I care about the welfare of the child. And so the welfare of the child will make them better. When you get them to know you turn them over to somebody who's gonna make them out of a man to be a contributor to society. With Harbaugh there, does Mike, what is that With like Harbaugh for Mike? Is, but that's the key thing about Harbaugh. I say, he do a lot of hard recruiting. He make you think, he make you think about what you wanna do. And that's why he had an opportunity to make Mike Weber think about being here. He made me think about it, but it was a, it was a family decision, and it was a good decision. So I have no qualms about what he did. The thing is, I love relationships. I want to keep relationships because relationships is what makes you build upon to get players different places, open up different doors, and that's what it's all about. The big narrative now is Urban versus Harbaugh. What does that mean for the battleground that your high school is? I mean, head the to head, the battleground of my high school. Your high school is a battleground. You know, I have a lot of great players between now and 2017 come out of Castec High School. We may have about at least 25 offers between two class or more. But the key thing is the kids' best interests, the kids' welfare, and the coaches who can make assure me that they're going to watch out for the kids and make sure the kids get an opportunity, they get a degree, go to school, have fun, play football, and leave there for opportunity to get a job and be a contributor to society is where my kids will go. And I know for a fact that Michigan being Michigan is some place that people is going to love. And being here in the state is some place people are going to love because they want to play in front of the home crowd. So again, it's all about the welfare of the child. So Ohio State.